Watch Days of Our Lives, weeknights at 6 and 11 on SoapNet. Everybody, everybody! Oh, right. I need your attention <laughs> while you're still able to give it. Yes. Oh, hurry up. Please. Now, as many of you know, I like to make my New Year's toast a little bit early in the evening. Yes, sweetheart. Before the place crowds up, everybody's head gets a little fuzzy. Right. <laughs> now... How about your own job? <laughs> <laughs> Too late for that. I'm doing my best. Yeah. Here we are. Here is to what's going to make me happy in 1977. Friends like you and a family like mine. Ah, ah, lovely, John. Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Now it's my turn, my turn. This is to John, my darling husband, to all our children and all our dear friends, including Sean over there, who's Kevin's cousin, just here from County Mayo. Hey. I love you all. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and here's to new beginnings and old friendships. Oh, oh, that's that's right. And the next generation. To baby. Hey, 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 Get yourself another drink. What's troubling you, dear? Is it Jack? Yeah, we should be a part of this. Just a little. Well, maybe he'll change his mind and come downstairs. I mean, there's such good feelings in the air tonight, hmm? Yeah, talk to me, huh? Sure, just don't ignore your date. Kid. No, I won't. I think I need you and Faith right now. Delia's over there sending me distress signals from the kitchen, and I'm resisting them, but it ain't all that easy. Okay, I'll stick by it. <laughs> what? What are you doing here hiding in the corner? Go on out and enjoy yourself. Come on, to the party. Well, have nobody to be with. Nobody. Just your entire family and all your dear friends. Go on, scoot. Get in there. I think I'll be I'll be off to the Jills. Happy New Year, Dad. Ah, oh, oh, listen, wait a minute. Here, save a knees. To Jill, my best wishes okay. for a happy New Year. Thank you. Okay. Happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. So, where else are you off to tonight? A friend of ours has a loft in Soho, friend of Faith's, and he invited us down along with a couple hundred other people. <laughs> well, at least it should be pretty interesting. I think it sounds terrific. You know, Maeve wanted the whole family to be together tonight, so I think she would feel very bad if you left. Well, she knows that we're going. I don't think we'll be missed with all the partying. Speaking of partying, let's get you a drink. Come on. Yeah, you have another customer here. Oh, sweetheart, how about a beer for these? Mary? Uh, did your dad tell you that a few of us are getting together for a little private toast around about midnight? That's right, that's right. Tonight's the night I break over that little bottle of 25-year-old bourbon I've been saving from Alex's mother's private stock. His mm. mother's private still, you mean? Uh, okay. Alex, is this going to be a night to remember? Well, actually, when you uh, drink my mother's home brew, you don't count on remembering a whole lot. <laughs> I don't want to go down there. And I don't want to have my own little private party with Mary up here, either. I'd be lousy company. I'm uh, better off alone tonight. Oh. Jack, is the gloom because of your sexual problem? Mostly, but I don't want to discuss it. I wish you would. I mean, I'm not about to blush, you know. And Mary is not about to pine away about it either. I mean, she's not downstairs thinking about her love life. She just wants you there with her, Jack. Please. Please, Jack.
enemies when you're Todd Manning. This week. On every my identity, my family thing from my life. Now the moment his family never expected. Oh my God. Who are you? I'm Todd Manning. And you're not. Watch One Life to Live. Weekdays on ABC and weeknights at 9 on SoapNet. People are talking about General Hospital's Laura Wright and her recent Emmy win. Octavia Evans posted on Facebook, congrats, it is well deserved. Michelle Taylor adds, I love Carly on the show. She makes every episode eventful. And Kim Lally agrees, she's a terrific actress. People are talking about General Hospital, weekdays on ABC and weeknights at 10 on SoapNet. Bare Minerals is the original. Millions of women worldwide love Bare Minerals because it changes more than your skin. Bare Minerals will change your life. This is smooth, it's nice, and it covers. I like that. Bare Minerals is the only foundation I would ever use. Ever. 100% pure Bare Minerals is not like any other makeup. It looks like beautiful bare skin while it covers whatever you want it to. No matter what your skin type or condition, Bare Minerals is for you. Best of all, now is a great time to start going bare because right now you can get everything you need for flawless coverage. And a new favorite, Click Lock Go gives you a spill-proof way to take Bare Minerals Foundation with you anywhere. We also have an exclusive bonus collection worth $57.95, free. And it's all yours for more than 75% off retail. Our introductory Get Started Kit includes Bare Minerals Foundation for flawless coverage. We promise a perfect shade match or your money back. You'll also receive warmth for a healthy glow. Mineral Veil, the ultimate finishing touch. And Bare Minerals Professional Flawless Application Brush. Call right now and you'll also receive three fabulous full-size and totally free gifts, including Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. Purchased separately, you'd spend over $120. So our original Get Started Kit was a great deal at two payments of $29.99. But if you call right now, this entire seven-piece set is yours for just one payment of $29.99. That's right. Order direct and receive everything you see here for only one payment of $29.99. That's over 75% off the retail price, a savings of over $90. It's not expensive. It lasts for such a long time. Bare Minerals is my miracle. With our 30-day money-back guarantee, you have nothing to lose. To save over 75%, call 1-800-235-3320. Ask how you can receive this handy compact. Call 1-800-235-3320 now. Oh, you happy people. Happy New Year. Kevin, would you mind conveying my greetings to the Ryan family? I don't believe they heard me. I believe they heard you quite clearly, Dr. Coleridge. Tell me he's not worth throwing out. He's not even worth the attention you've already given him. Happy New Year, little sister. Roger. Excuse me. I'm sorry, Roger. Why don't you tell me all about it in the kitchen? I wish I could. I can. I have to help Johnny. Well, if you don't mind everyone overhearing what I have to say, it's perfectly all right with me. Sorry. I'm really sorry. I I'm miserable because I hurt you, and that's the last thing in the world that I wanted to do. What happened, Delia? Well, well, I got scared. See, I was in the cabin all by myself. And I was thinking about little John, and I, and I couldn't leave him, and I, I was too far away, so I panicked. Y you forgive me. Well, I got scared, too. But after you left. You see, the entire ship was searched. And for two hours, I thought maybe you were lost or uh, hurt, or maybe even overboard. When I discovered that your suitcase was gone, you can imagine my relief and my confusion. I know I was really confused, too. And, and I know I was being awful, and it was crazy for me to leave without a note. You see, I looked out the porthole, and I saw the last gang plank being pulled in. And I don't know, I just picked up my, my bags, and I ran. That's funny. That's not the way I heard it. What do you mean? Well, according to my sister, Pat came on board, persuaded you to change your mind, and escorted you back home. Your sweet sister and her big mouth. She just couldn't wait to tell you, could she? I mean, she really didn't have to do that. I mean, why did you let me go on like that if you knew that Pat came there? Because I wanted to hear what kind of story you'd come up with, and you did very well. 
Would you let me explain it to you? No. No, that won't be necessary. See, uh, I just want you to know that my leaving didn't have anything to do with Pat coming in, okay? I had made up my mind before that, all right? I swear. So Pat just uh, showed up out of the clear blue, just in time to help you carry your bags. Yeah, I died when he walked in. I really did. And all that watching out the porthole, I mean, you weren't looking for Pat. No, no. Well, in your panic when the ship's whistle blew. Your questions to the steward. Oh, uh, you said, Graham, uh, if a very important visitor uh, showed up, would he be allowed on board? Now, you weren't talking about Pat. No, no. And the note that you left the Ryan family, it didn't by any chance say exactly when and where you were leaving the country? You didn't by any chance want to go by ship to give Pat ample time to rescue you. What's wrong, honey? You run out of lies? Twisting everything around, I'm telling you the truth. Except, Except for one moment in that cabin, you have told me nothing but lies. You conned the con man, baby. Exactly one thing that you said was honest. And that's that you don't deserve my love. And you don't deserve the kind of life that I wanted to give you. And that's really a shame, sweetheart. Because we could have had one hell of a life together. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, please. Tonight, I would like to pay homage to a very special person. She's part child, part goddess, and all witch. I give you Delia Reed Ryan. And may God help you all. Let's get the show back on the road. Somebody turn up that jukebox, will you? Yeah. And everybody, let's get back to the business of welcoming in the new year, right? Refills, everybody. Oh, your knees are crumbling. <laughs> <laughs> Here you are, Patrick. I ordered my... All oh, yours. Thank you. Thank you. All right. <laughs> A whole pitcher up here. I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, uh, you had to face Roger sometime, Dee. At least it's all over. It's not over because nobody's going to forget what he said. He said I was wicked and evil. Well, come on. What did you expect? You knew he'd be furious. I wasn't expecting abuse like that. I was expecting somebody to defend me. Now, where's Bobby? He could have done that. Look. I'm sorry. Quick, please go upstairs and, and talk. Anna, Anna, I'm shaking. Please just stay upstairs with me until I stop shaking, okay? I'm not going to do that, Dee. I'm feeling sick. I'm going to sit down, all right? Oh. Do you feel a little lightheaded? Yeah, and I'm shivering also. Oh. Pat, why didn't you get her some cognac? Oh, no, no, no. It's okay. I'm, uh, I'm fine, really. Well, I think maybe Faith is right. Now, 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 now. We're the doctors, and we know what's good for you. Go ahead, Pat. Just in a little shot glass. <laughs> Pat and I are spending New Year's Eve together. Just the two of us. And you are not invited to join us. You be quiet and leave me alone. No. You leave us alone. You're not going to spoil this evening, Delia. Now, what you are going to do is go away. How dare you speak for Pat? I'm not speaking for anyone but myself, and this is what I'm saying. Butt out. Leave. Disappear. Now. Goodbye. You don't own Pat. And I'm not leaving here unless he tells me to. And not one minute sooner. Well, I'll bet you a million dollars. Ah! Ah! I'm, I'm okay. Oh, it's all right, honey. It's all right. We'll wipe that up. Uh, come on. Get in there. It's all right, just a little beer, folks. Oh, my Look, just go on upstairs and, and soak it in ice cold water. You don't have to use soap or anything. It's, it's running all the way go down. Go on it's before it dries. Oh, shoes maybe you could soak your shoes, too. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Oh, Delia, why would I do a thing like that? Uh, it, was a, it was a simple accident, that's all. Uh, look, uh, come on upstairs, sweetheart, and get yourself in some dry clothes. Come on, come on, come on. Mary? Let's get out of here. 
out of here. <laughs> when? Where? Tell I don't me. care as long as it's far away. You mean that? How far? Well, a thousand miles would be just dandy. <laughs> Listen, I got the next couple of days on. If you could get some time, why don't we go to the beach house and just relax? I mean, as friends, just to start the new year peacefully. Uh, I'd love to. You didn't get any of that uh, BLU, did you? No, not a drop. It's just my luck. <laughs> <laughs> One question. Uh, you think you could do a little magic on the schedule and give me the next two days off? Well, let me tune in up on my magic work hat and let's see as opposed to playing. You got anybody to cover for you? Oh, I'll do it. He'll do it. Oh, oh, you have to pay me back in January. I will. Thanks, Buck. Okay. Uh, listen, since I'm going to do all this for you, uh, what are you up to, if you don't mind me asking? Oh, we're going to the beach house. Uh oh Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I uh, want you to know you've got two days you're a free man. You understand? Yes, perfectly. And let's get out of here before he changes his mind. <laughs> hey, listen, my car's a couple of blocks away. Do you want to stop by the hospital and get your clothes? Yeah, yeah. Hey, have a good time. Oh, yeah. Hey, you too, man. <laughs> Thanks, bud. And uh, give our regards to Delia. Yeah, I'll take care of her. Would you take this? Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Hey, Happy New Year. Yeah, you too. Oh, oops. Oh, have fun. Look at this. Hey. Uh, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Bye. Happy New Year. Bye. Oh, honey. You're wonderful. <laughs> understand the pain that I'm feeling. The Spencers have never been more vulnerable. It's Jax. He's back. Can't you go any faster? Oh my god. Watch General Hospital weekdays on ABC and weeknights at 10 on SoapNet. Genoa City, a place for families to fall apart. I will get my daughter back. You betrayed me. I'm done with you. There's no more family. The Young and the Restless, tonight at 7 on SoapNet. Who could resist the call of America's number one puppy food brand? With DHA and essential nutrients also found in mother's milk. Purina Puppy Chow. Who knew this getting older thing could go so smoothly? See up to 10 years disappear in a stroke with new Visible Lift Smooth Absolute Foundation from L'Oreal. Smooth skin to ageless perfection. Our luxurious brush takes years off instantly, filling lines and smoothing wrinkles, while hydrocollagen plumps and hydrates. 91% of women saw smoother skin right away. Smooth is the new young. New Visible Lift Smooth Absolute. 10 years smooth away in an instant. Only from L'Oreal. We can be sexy forever. Because we're worth it. I'm Joanna from Texas. I lost 34 pounds with HydroxyCut. I'm Robert from Chicago, and I lost 43 pounds. I'm Kareen from New York, and I lost 51 pounds with HydroxyCut. It really works. HydroxyCut and HydroxyCut Max. Lose weight. Start now. Melanie's the key to his lost memories. Why would Melanie have been there? That's exactly what we have to find out. Now, can Brady keep her safe? He is not going to go after Melanie. Or will she fall right into EJ's clutches? <laughs> Watch Days of Our Lives, weeknights at 6 and 11 on SoapNet. Next week on only jam-packed years, Hey Little Monsters, she's back. Pop sensation Lady Gaga performs live on our stage. Plus, late-night talker Jimmy Fallon and Katie Couric gets into her comfort zone as guest co-host. Next week on All New Views on ABC. I decided the least I could do was dress up a little for New Year's. What do you think? You know what I think. Come here. Mm. Mm. I am so tired of resting on that sofa. Listen, how do you feel, really? Fine, really. No complications all day, no nothing. <laughs> you know, I really have a hunch that 1977 is going to be our year. I should put these on ice. Yeah, that was sweet of Johnny. We have to call Ryan's at midnight. Uh, they'd never hear the telephone. <laughs> <laughs> He's really doing his job, huh? Taking care of me? He's a wonder. You know, we have a new year, and we have an angel who really knows his business. Now, if that isn't a sign of happiness, I don't know what is. What's the matter? Nothing. I was just thinking about that wild party over at Ryan's. 
and how much I would like to just go there for a little while. You know, I thought you might be interested in a brief outing. Would you like to hear my proposal? Yes, yes, anything to get out of this apartment. How about a taxi ride to a nice tall skyscraper, then an elevator ride to a nice quiet cocktail lounge, just one drink while we sit, hold hands, and survey the whole city, and then right back home again? I love it. Just let me get my coat. Ah, allow me. <laughs> Oh, thank you very much. Come on, let's go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. What's all this about? It's a short cure for Julian's cabin fever. We'll be back in about an hour. Come That's on, a quick. very dangerous plan. Happy New Year. I've been resting with my feet up all day. Yeah, well, that's what you should be doing all evening. I'm sure you're tired of staying at home, but after all, there is a child to consider. Yeah, my child, and I'm not about to do anything to endanger it. What do you think I'm going to do? Take her to Times Square along with half of New York City? It'd be a mistake to take her anywhere. Can I make myself a drink? Sure, have two, three, and by the time you finish, we may be back, if you've decided not to wait for us. You wouldn't have a day to yourself for New Year's Eve. I didn't think so, come on. Jillian, going out would be extremely ill-advised. Are you threatening her? No, no, of course he's not. But he does have a point. Why not stick to Johnny Champagne and uh, the view out my window? It seems like a better idea. You know, I notice you have a very proprietary attitude toward Jill. You give orders, she's expected to obey. Well, how do you feel free in doing that? I'd like an explanation, Seneca. Next, take a trip to the Upper West Side on Ryan's Hope. Later, spend some time in Genoa City with the Young and the Restless, only on SoapNet. Erica King snaps. Next stop, OK then. We're gonna have so much fun. Janet! Now it's one crazy run-in after another. Oh my god, Dixie! Leading up to the most amazing reunion yet. Watch All My Children, weekdays on ABC and weeknights at 8 on SoapNet. Got a lot of enemies in Todd Manning. This week. On every, my identity, my family, thing from my life. Now the moment his family never expected. Oh my god. Who are you? I'm Todd Manning. And you're not. Watch One Life to Live, weekdays on ABC, and weeknights at 9 on SoapNet. The way bugs see it, your home is their home. But you can build a barrier that kills bugs dead. Raid Max Bug Barrier. Its automatic trigger lets you lay down a continuous barrier that's fast working and long lasting. Out. Build a barrier indoors and out with Raid Max Bug Barrier. Now in a gallon jug, too. SC Johnson, a family company. Ooh. What you got there? Um, oh, sesame stir fry from Lucky Dynasty. Oh, me too. But mine's Lean Cuisine, so no preservatives. Lean Cuisine has 90 dishes with no preservatives and quality ingredients like farm picked broccoli and tender white meat chicken. Lean Cuisine. Bold. Hold. Discover the hold of a long wear in the luxury of a lipstick. Infallible La Rouge from L'Oreal. Fancy. 30 luscious shades with breakthrough power hold pigments and nourishing vitamin E for the most luxurious 10-hour color. L'Oreal's Infallible La Rouge. There are some things you can't control. The weather. The front page. The stock market, obviously. We're hearing the one thing no one wants to hear. Cancer. Okay, things you can control. What you know before treatment. There's a high risk of infection during chemotherapy. So don't let anything interrupt your fight against cancer. Talk to your doctors and go to manageyourtreatment.com. There are some things you can't control, but this you honestly can. Want more of your favorite soaps? That's great. Log on to abc.com slash daytime. Watch current full episodes of All My Children, General Hospital, and One Life to Live. Online critics love it. Plus, get exclusive sneak peeks of what's coming up next. Sounds like a thumbs up to me. Connect with other fans to discuss what's on your mind. I always want to hear what you have to say. And check out the 101 galleries to get an intimate look at the history of your favorite characters. That's the best news I've heard all day. Find it all now at abc.com slash daytime. This summer, the party's on SoapNet. We have a party to rock. You will never take over my life. Nothing is going to change how I feel about you. I love Ken Dye, baby. Oh, it is so on. What? Shut up! And you won't believe who's coming. You're back. This is one summer shindig you don't want to miss. I am ready to have the summer of my life. Only on SoapNet. Down. I'm wondering.
sovereign why for it never should be there at all with such power in your smile you're a stone you'll beguile so there's never a teardrop should fall when your sweet lilt in laughter's like some fairy song and your eyes twinkle bright as can be you should laugh all the while and all other times smile and now smile a smile for me when Irish eyes are smiling, sure it's like a morning spring in the middle of I think that dress looks even better than the one you had on before. You look terrific. Thank you. Where's Pat? I don't know, I must have gone out. Yeah, I guess uh, Faith took him to her big fancy party down somehow, huh? Yeah, well, I, anyway, I don't know where he is unless he's hiding behind the bar someplace. Helia? Thanks, Helia. Helia! My cousin Sean would like to meet you. Would you go up and have a water with him? Yeah, well, he looks nice. I should talk to somebody, I guess. See you later. All the world seems bright and gay, but when Irish eyes are smiling, sure they steal your heart away. Oh, I have a good tenor. <laughs> Jack? Jack, it's awfully good to see you out of the sick bed. Is it? Huh? I, uh, I even like the snarled greeting. Sounds like the old Jack again. We both know that it's not quite the old Jack, don't we? Have a good time, my wife. Alex, would you bring this back to the bar for me? It's a little too strong. Sure. He's one of the best friends you've got. Please don't start with him. I like him because he likes you and he doesn't put up with your nonsense, but I'm not in love with him. I'm in love with you. Want to try a little bit? Mm. All right. You add water to down considerably. Jack, bourbon on the rocks for you? Thanks. Now, come on. Don't tell me that's not great stuff. It's my mother's the best there is. Tastes like rubbing alcohol. Ah, uh, no, I beg to differ, sir. Well, you can differ to your blue in the face, mister. When it comes to good bourbon, I'll damn sight more than you do. Mother yeah. or no mother. Come on. Look, if I'm gonna stay down here, I'm taking orders from you or him or anybody else. Well, then maybe you shouldn't stay. It's hard for him to face a crowd like this when he's feeling shaky. I can't even be mad at him. Well, I can. <sighs> Glad we didn't go to that party. <laughs> oh, so am I. Let me warm the place up a little bit. Okay. back here, the quiet always amazes me. Nobody around for miles, huh? No. Not this time of year. We're hardly ever alone, you know? Yeah, I know. Don't stay way over there. It's still too far away. In Port Charles, revenge is a priority, relationships are disposable, and good medical care is a necessity. Keep up with this fast-paced city with an